and you don't seem to understand. Man, I was by this place and I saw this chick with this super gargantula ass, bro. Super fat ass, man. I ain't gonna lie, it looked like she was wearing a diaper. But man, that ass was just crazy. She had these, uh, these short pink shorts on. I ain't gonna lie, she looked like a prostitute, but that ass was still fat though. But anyways, man, good news, bro. Good news. My uh, recruiter just called me today. I was gonna wait until Wednesday to uh, hit him up. But, you know, I spoke to him today. And he was telling me, man, that, uh, what's it called? Uh, I guess the administrator on, his, on on their end fucked up the paperwork. So he had to send the uh, waivers over and stuff like that. But the way he's talking to me, man, is some good fucking news. You know what I mean? For those that were asking about what I did or what the charge was, it was a felony. You know, it was a felony charge. I didn't get uh, the charge I got right now is the misdemeanor, but I had a felony charge, man. And y'all gonna be like, well, what'd you say? What'd you do? I ain't telling you motherfuckers nothing. I ain't telling y'all shit. I ain't telling y'all shit. So, and uh, I keep rubbing my lip, man. It's my, uh, my cut healer. It's not a cold sore. I keep saying that shit, I'll be fucked. Anyways, uh, yeah, I'm excited, man. My friend is, uh, he was thinking about going on reserves, but he was like, nah, man, fuck that. Fuck that. We got to go active duty. So, you know, he's going to have, he's going to take his podcast and then his MEPS, I guess. And, uh, everything's cool. He's just wearing the same day, man. I'm hoping that I myself can swear in this week. It did. This week, I'm hoping I can swear in. You know? I swear in, man. I'm Gucci, Gucci, Louis, Louis, Vindi, Vindi, Prada. So, yeah. I'm excited. Words can't describe, man. I've been waiting since fucking February the 2nd. You know? It all started February the 2nd when I had, uh, I called the Army recruiter because I wanted to go with the Army. Didn't answer Called the Navy recruiter. The chief supervisor told me to uh, call this other number. Another chief who was my main recruiter. You know, he picked me up, he did the paperwork. Uh, I kept pushing back the uh, MEPS because I had to work because I'm like, I gotta pay this damn court ticket. But at this point, they don't even, they're not even worried about the damn court ticket, bruh. I'm like, let's get it. So, you know, I'm, so fucking close man so fucking close you know i'm hoping that everything goes in you know with the charges i had because i don't have a i don't have the um the what's it called the felony charge anymore the judge had dropped it to a, a misdemeanor you know out of pity he's like probably this stupid ass nigga doing this dumb shit white judge of course but anyways man you know i'm so excited Say fucking English. Say fucking English. Yo. You know, I'm working at this country job, country club job as a bartender. And I'm just like, man, I can't be serving these old rich men, old wealthy men for the rest of my time or for a fucking few years or whatever. Fuck no, can't do that shit. Mm -mm. So, you know, um, going to the Navy. When I go in there to swear in, I'm signing for a, a, a IT job in tech. A, a, a friend, the friend I'm talking about, a guy we know, he's an officer in the Navy. So he's giving me information on what good jobs to choose and pick. He sent me a, a dictionary to learn about terminology. So today I'm gonna study that, look over it. One day. I'm gonna have it one day, one day. We gonna get it one day. Yeah, yeah. So I'm walking in the rain, man, and I love the rain. It makes me feel good. It activates my Samoan powers. Yeah, 
But I'm so fucking happy, dog. I'm so fucking happy. I don't give a... My, my friend in the Air Force is making fun of me. He's like, your big ass gonna have to be on the boat. Nigga, I don't give a shit. Get me out of this lame ass city. Get me out of Baton Rouge, Louisiana real quick, man. Fuck. But, man. You don't seem to understand. So, yeah, man. I'm so fucking happy. I'm following my uh, friend's diet plan, bro. I'm like three. I'm three hundred nine point four. You know, I'm just. I'm trying my best, man. And I'm hanging in there. You know, I'm trying my. And that's what I want you guys to do is to hang the fuck in there, man. You're going through some shit. You know, you guys may be probably going to the army and the marines and you're fat as a bitch. And the weight loss that they want you to get under is probably it's probably hard as fuck, man. You hang in there. Your stupid ass probably got. I met this uh, kid at MEPS in the Navy base in uh, New Orleans, and he wanted to join the Air Force, but he was like he was probably gonna get denied because he was one of the badass kids. It was a white kid too. It's one of those white kids that are, you know, you know what I'm saying, kind of hood. You know what I mean? But he was like, Air Force may not take me because I have multiple suspensions for fighting. And I was like, man, keep your head up, dog. You know, even if I say, you don't have any charges, right? He said, nope. Because that the Air Force saw that I was a bad kid in uh, high school. I was like, don't even worry about that, man. Because even if the Air Force don't want to take you, dog, you can still go to the Army or the Navy. You know, so if y'all got felony charges, man, as long as you ain't murder nobody, rape nobody, nothing diabolical, you can still you can still get in, man. Or you probably got like I got all these fucking tattoos, and like they don't want me, man. Fuck it. Go to the recruiter, man. If you really want this shit, you'll save up and get the ta- and get the uh the tattoo removed, or you'll get a tattoo to hide that shit. This year, man, 2024, we locked the fuck in. I got a friend in the Air Force, Parker. He's about to get his masters and shit like that. He's locked the fuck in. My friend Hicks, he's about to join the army. He as active duty full time. He's locked the fuck in. I'm about to go to the Navy full duty, man. I told myself four years, but fuck, I'm thinking about doing five. Five, get my college credits up, degrees ready. So when I get in, get back into that civilian lifestyle and I want to pursue acting full time, I ain't gonna be like a lot of these other guys who, you know, are broke as hell. Had to climb under this gate. Um, when I go into acting, I won't be a broke motherfucker. Hell no. I'll be good. I have a bachelor's and something making good fucking money. So, gotta get after that shit, man. Gotta get after that shit. Straight up. So, I'm excited. Y'all should be excited, man. Coast Guard, Air Force, Space Force, Marines, Army, Navy, and the National Guard, man. Y'all can do so much, so I put the work in. But it's raining, and I need some thug music, man. 50 Cent, let's get it.